Hi, my name is Sheena Joy and I'm going to do a card today based on a stamp set I got while I was in the States recently. It's called um, Cold Avocado Soup by Jelly Bean Soup. So it's a really pretty stamp set. I'm going to use these three floral images here and this sentiment, life is better when you're laughing. So we're going to do a one layer card today. I have a piece of uh, white card stock from Recollections. Um, it's cut to four and a quarter by 11 inches. So we'll score that. Score that at five and a half. Give it nice good pressure when you're scoring it so it does have a nice fold. When I first started card making I learned why score lines were important and that's because you could have a nice good fold with your card and your paper doesn't crack. So we have our card base. So what I plan to do, like I said, is put on the sentiment here in the corner and then I'm going to stamp the flowers with different um, ink pads that have different shades of pink and purples. The sentiment itself, I'm going to use this VersaFine um, Onyx Black Pigment Ink. So now I'm going to take the different uh, flower images and I'm going to put them on my acrylic blocks. And no need to use the compact stamp press for these little flowers. I mean, you could if you wanted to. Everybody's different what they prefer. I just, I'm going to be switching up the colors a lot. So I know with the compact stamp press, you have to um, keep on turning it around, obviously, and it's bigger. Also, I'm going to put this uh, scratch paper underneath my card. And I'm just going to keep it folded just because I want to go over this edge and you could open it up if you want to and then mask off the other uh, piece of it. So, alright, so I have different inks. I have these Memento Dewdrop Scrape Jelly, uh, Lilac Roses. I have different color box um, inks. There's pink, lavender, raspberry, Simon Says Stamp Doll Pink, and a Memento Lux Ink Lilac Poses posies I should say. Alright so I'm going to start off with the big one and I'm going to go for the deep pink. I had mentioned that I was at my niece's recently and she had bought her first ink pad while I was there and so I can remember when I first started stamping, I didn't know how to even ink up my pad. <laughs> I didn't know what you needed for stamps or, you know, I mean, we all have to start somewhere and we all start at the basics. So just put this down here in the corner. And first I was going to do this different colors, like incorporate greens and yellows and oranges and don't get me wrong that would be really pretty too. Oh, see that's so pretty. So I am going to speed up the video for the rest of the stamping um, and you'll see I'll use this whole variety. Okay. Okay, where's my corner chomper? It's right here. Alright, so I'll put that up and I'm going to use the half inch corner rounder. And I'm just going to uh, round the tops. Okay. 
Okay, and put that scratch paper to the side. And I'm going to embellish uh, the card with uh, these enamel dots. And this variety of colors is from Recollections, and these this pink variation is from Doodlebug. So this is called Cupcake Assortment, and these are just, they don't have a name. <laughs> They're called enamel dot stickers. So I have this quick stick, We Are Memory Keepers, uh, by We Are Memory Keepers, and I'm going to use this. And this quick stick has two ends, and one is to pick up uh, things that are small, and one is just to kind of help you get things off of just like this. And of course, it's not going to work. There we go. So just love this. And I'm just going to use a whole variety of sizes and pinks and purples. And I just love having these this color family. I mean, I could have went with blues. I looked at my collection of inks, and I find I have more within this color family. So kind of stuck with what I have more of. And what I have more of is obviously what I like. And pinks and purples just remind me so much about summer and, and spring too. Just gonna open up this package to get the smaller purple ones. So I really like this uh, quick stick tool. I used it before this on another card and I found it really helpful. Hmm. And I like how these doodle bug um, sprinkles have the whole variety of pinks and it's kind of what I was going for on this card. The variety. And just showing how a one layer card can have a lot of depth too because of the variety of colors and I wonder if I put one in the middle here. But then if I do that then I'll have to put in the middle of all of them, so I'm not gonna do that. I'm just gonna put it to the side here. So I think I just about have one or two left to add. I'm just looking at this and I mean I want to have it nice and full but then I don't want to have it too busy either so. Okay, so there we have our card. Life is better when you're laughing and a whole variety of colors with a little uh, flower stamps and a sprinkling of enamel dots so really loving the card and anybody would love to get this card so I hope it inspires you to make a card too and thank you for watching subscribe to my channel if you'd like to see more of my videos and I hope you're well okay thanks take care bye